This is a form that I use to help my children develop their own self-image. Self-image, as we define it, is the opinion that they hold of themselves. And so I tell my girls, also my, you know, my sons, you have an opinion of yourself, whether it's a good opinion or not so good opinion, or maybe neutral, you can change that. And the only way we change behavior is we first change our self-image. And so we were talking about, you know, if I want to be somebody who was really um, disciplined with my homework, then we have to change the image that we have of ourselves as somebody who's really disciplined with our homework. So here's a formula. And you can use it with your children. We teach it. It's S-H-R. Your self-image actually determines the habits you create for yourself consistently, then determines your results. If you want to be able to change your result, maybe you want to have more homework, you want to be more fit, you want to be, you know, happier, then you have to change your habits. The habits cannot be sustainably changed if you don't change the image of you holding the hold of yourself. And the easiest part is that you can change your self-image any any time. You just need to change the way you rewire your understanding of yourself. And so that's why I was trying to train my children. So you can change your self-image at any time, any moment, if your image that you hold of yourself does not actually produce the result that you want. And I think when they understand that, they can say, oh, okay, S-H-R, and they can do it themselves over and over again. I think that's the beauty of the self-image is that we can change it in, in any given moment and we can redesign ourselves.